Hi everyone and welcome to our next tutorial. In this tutorial we're going to take a look at how we can program our robot um, to get it to do a simple function. So when you open up the software Robot C Graphical you're going to see a bunch of tools on the left hand side here. These are all drop and drag tools that we can use to program our robot. We're going to start with a really simple one here. We're going to use the forward command. I'm going to click and drag it into this space here and let go. And this is a forward command and basically it defaults to this that it will run the robot forward for one rotation at a robot speed or motor speed of 50%. So I'm going to change this to five rotations just so it runs a little bit longer and I'm going to save that program. This is practice1.rgb. Now in order to get it to run on my robot I need to first compile the program. Remember when you compile a program that simply simply takes the graphical instruction that I have here converts it to a language that the robot understands. So I'm going to compile and I didn't get any errors here if there was a mistake somewhere with my code if I got to put if I missed a number here it's going to tell me that there's an error. Didn't get an error message so I'm going to download to the robot. Now I could also get an error here if for instance I forgot to plug in the communication cable as it's shown here. So just watch out for communication errors. That just means you do not have the cable connected properly to your robot. So I'm going to just save this again. I don't know if I saved it the first time. And again, I will compile and let's download to the robot. And so there, it's successfully downloaded. I didn't get any errors. I could disconnect this cable if I want to, but I'm just going to keep it in there. I'm going to go over to the EV3 and I'm just going to press to the second tab and then I'm going to find my program and press start. So. You can see the wheels turning for my simple program. That is simply all you do using the graphical instructions that you find on the left hand side to drop and drag into your workspace here. Don't forget to save your work. Make sure you compile and then download to your robot. You can disconnect the cable if you wish. I've got my robot just mounted on something so the wheels can turn here. That's it for this tutorial. Talk to you soon.